Okay, with that removed, now we're going to vacuum and clean all this rubbish in. I pulled that out just to make it a bit easier. Oh, same thing. I don't know what people do in these cars, but so much crap in there. I have to get the baby wipes. Okay, that's a lot better. Uh, that's using baby wipes. So I'll now start cutting this bubbled rubbish off the top. Okay, next, we'll take off this uh, gear knob selector thing, whatever you call it. Important not to lose that little screw. Put it somewhere safe. Okay. Oh, that was pretty easy. So we'll put that in after. All right. Now we're gonna cut off all these bubbles. And if you look closely, you'll see the bubbles here, here, around the edge at the back there. So what I'm gonna do is smooth this out. And if I have to cut it and peel it off, I will. It's just, it's just like a some sort of film, and then I can put the new one on. So just bear with us. As you can see, you can peel this foil, whatever this is, off. And what we're going for is a smooth surface um, that this new one can adhere to. See there. So we want to get as smooth as possible. So I'm just going to keep peeling off these bubbles. Okay, it's coming along, getting rid of all that rubbish. Okay, still going. Nearly got it off. Okay, that's pretty much, I think, um, as good as we'll get. <clears throat> okay, now we are ready to um, put the chrome piece on. It's going to be chrome, I'll take that off after. It's a double sided tape. Now we're going to place that and stick it on. Okay, that's now on the fascia. I'll peel the double sided tape off from here and peel it off in a moment. Okay. And there she is. Absolutely beautiful. Now put the gear shift on. The knob and then the fascia. Okay, knobs back on. Now we'll screw it back in like so. Your knobs on. Now I'll put this cover back on over there. Oh, hang on, I'll put the drink holder in. Now I'm going to do this with two hands so I don't make a mistake. And hey, presto, there. It's your new chrome around. I'm very happy with this.